Good evening, I'm Alex Sykes with a look at your news headlines. Concerns over the safety of children at Ashley Youth Detention Centre have been left unanswered for almost a day. Questions were raised in budget estimates whether individuals named in the 2014 Royal Commission still work at Ashley. The department confirming late this afternoon that they don't. A severe weather warning has been issued in Tasmania for the second time this week. A cold front is expected to cross Tasmania later tonight, bringing gusts of more than 100 kilometres per hour to the south. Hobart is once again in the firing line, but winds should ease tomorrow morning. And new statistics have revealed that drowning incidents have increased in Tasmania and across Australia in the past year. Seven Tasmanians have lost their lives to drowning, while nationally the rate has risen by 20%. The figures show middle-aged men are more at risk. To weather and looking ahead to tomorrow, windy with showers across the state. Hobart and Launceston, 18. Burnie and Devonport, both 17. Strawn to top, 16 degrees. St Helens showers easing a max of 19, Swansea to top 20 degrees. Looking further out to the mainland now and sunny across Adelaide, Alice Springs, Broome, Darwin and Sydney tomorrow. That's all the news for now. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Good night.